surgery for the breast in breast cancer is of two types you can remove the entire breast or you can do something called breast conservation surgery in which only the tumor is removed right earlier everybody used to do a mastectomy or removal of the breast we should remember two things if the surgeon can remove the tumor alone and leave the remaining breast number 1 and the patient wants to do that then we should go ahead with the breast conservation now i will give you an example it's a, the patient has a large breast and there is a small tumor the surgeon says i will be able to remove your tumor and save your breast the patient says i don't want it i want to remove the entire breast then though you can save the breast or though bcs is possible or breast conservation surgery is possible the patient doesn't want it hence we have to do a mastectomy so there are two things whether the surgeon can successfully do a bcs medically for which there are medical reasons and number two whether the patient wants it or not now what are the conditions in which you have to do a mastectomy i will tell you small breast and a large tumor then though the though sometimes we give chemotherapy to shrink the bre- uh, tumor even after that suppose the surgeon feels he cannot remove the tumor completely because the breast is in small in size then the surgeon has to remove the whole breast so large tumor in a small breast and even after giving chemotherapy beginning which is called new adjuvant chemotherapy if the surgeon is not confident of removing the tumor completely which we call tumor with negative margins then the whole breast has to be removed number 2 if tumor is located in multiple locations in the breast which is called multicentric disease number 3 if you have microcalcifications in the breast this is number 4 most importantly if the patient doesn't want a breast conservation the patient says i want a mastectomy that is an indication number 5 we have to remember whenever we do suppose the patient wants to get a bcs bcs is possible but remember one thing after bcs radiation is a must if a patient has already received the radiation if the patient has certain contraindications to radiation like some skin diseases or rheumatological conditions like scleroderma then radiation cannot be given if you cannot give radiation you should not do bcs so to summarize if the patient doesn't want a breast conservation surgery if the patient has received radiation before or has some skin conditions where you cannot give radiation because of which obviously you cannot do bcs or if the surgeon is not confident of getting negative margins or removing it completely or microcalcifications or multicentric breast disease these are the places or these are the conditions in which we have to do a mastectomy otherwise if it is a large breast small tumor surgeon can remove it easily with negative margins and patient is willing we should do a breast conservation surgery but bcs alone is not enough bcs plus radiation is called bct that is breast conservation surgery plus radiation is equal to breast conservation therapy breast conservation surgery plus radiation is equal to breast conservation therapy so we should give radiation for breast conservation or after breast conservation if we do this the results are equal to mastectomy so today when breast conservation is possible women need not remove the entire breast but remember after removal of the tumor and undergoing breast conservation they need local radiation mm-hmm.